Hey guys, uh, welcome to Jelly Farm, this was Street Farm. Uh, today we have gotten our trees on. And uh, if you can see, it, we've gotten trees from Pine Grove Nursery, and that's from Pennsylvania. We're out in the newspaper, an unboxing event. Okay. Uh, as you can see here, they did a pretty good job wrapping them up. Wow. Um, as you can see here, uh, we got 35 four year old white spruce, and I will cut these open. But the way they got them wrapped, I'm not sure. Might have to go ahead and clean them now. Or this one. Anyway, I, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But they, they're all come, they all come wrapped like this. And, and like a burlap type sack. So, we'll see. Let me go ahead and bring the camera over. You may not be able to see me, but I will get you a good picture of the actual of the actual trees. And uh, I'm gonna wrap. I'm gonna undo one uh, for you, maybe two or three. I don't know. And these are the four-year-olds. These are the four-year-olds. I got the camera up there. Uh, it's got to be a way, better way to cut these off. I'm not usually say this. Yeah, let's see if there's on the edge. Oh, don't do anything. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. There they are. So we need to wait. Uh, they got them wrapped so it's pretty nice. And then a plastic bag. Uh, I'll leave them until you get ready to put them in. I'm ready now. And you ain't got the holes filled or nothing yet. No, but I can put them in a the bucket. What bucket? You only got one. Oh, <laughs> uh, here. They got another. Uh, I'm going to cut the thing here. I've got the other two buckets in now. Okay. As you can see, I don't know if you can see, I hope you can, but there's the, the twine right there. It might be easier for that with the... Uh, right. Oh, yeah, nice and damp. Okay, I'm going to get one for you. Wow, check that out. Don't know if you can see that. Check that out. This is a four-year-old. There's not much wood on it, is it? That's going to be all right, though. That's a four-year-old. And I'm going to get the measuring tape. I'm back here. I'm going to show you the size from the root. Now this is a four-year-old tree, two feet, 24 inches. I do have some smaller in there. I do have some smaller trees in there, two-year-olds, but we'll see on those. Um, Right now we're only going to be able to do one opening at a time, so I think we're going to start off with the white spruces. It's a white spruce, by the way. They make a pretty good Christmas tree.
I'm trying to smell it a little bit more like. And Arvin's getting a uh, bucket of water. We're going to put these in some water. And then after we do that, I'll show you the next one while they soak in the water for a bit. I'd actually like to get a little better. If I can, it's two year old white spruce, but I don't want to keep it too much out of the moisture, so. Okay. So, we're inside, it's kind of cool in here. Yeah, maybe about 65. Um, so basically on a tree, I'm going to cover up the roof, basically on a tree, the longer you keep it, the longer you keep it out in the air, the worse, you know, uh, basically if you get the tree out of the bucket into the ground within 30 seconds, you're doing good. When we plant them, this is what we're going to use to plant. We got this auger here. We just got it not too long ago at Home Depot. And I'm not even sure what brand it is. But it's a red auger. And it is a six inch bit. You know, we could, we would have gotten a four inch bit, but we were like, well, you know what, we could use it for, uh, for, um, you know, post holes as well. Okay, now these, I don't know. These are of 40 Austrian pine and 50 Fraser fir. The Fraser fir are four year old and the Austrian pine are two year olds. So, I'm gonna take these and we're gonna go right out and plant them today too. So, and most of them. But that, I'll have that on another video. Oh, nice and damp group system. We're gonna probably wrap them up, keep them wrapped up until we. <laughs> yeah, this year they're soaking in water. Okay. These are the Fraser. Well, that one, that is Stragler Root. Okay, these are the four-year-old Frasers. I don't know, I need to... Okay, these are the four-year-old Frasers. And they are... Let me see, let me get our... And they are... 18, I'd say 18, 16 to 18, 20 inches sometimes, some of them. So they're, they're a pretty good thing, and they have a pretty good root system. However, I'm going to put these in a bucket, and the other ones, Scotch Pine, so I'll show you the Scotch Pine. I mean the Austrian Pine. And the Austrian pine, as you can see, they're two years old, and you know they're they're uh, they got a good root system. 
on them. And this here, what we're doing, we're not going to cut the root systems off. Last year, from the year before, we always, we always cut the root system because we did it with a double bar. Um, there we go. And then I'm going to wrap these up until the right form. And they, they got them wrapped up in a uh, burlap sack or a burlap bag. Okay, guys, and these are uh, two-year-old scotch, four-year-old balsam, three-year-old Norway fruit. So what I'm going to do, since I know we get to the balsam pretty quickly today, and I'm going to put that in the water. And I'm going to keep the others wrapped up. You're not going to plant them, don't take them out. Yeah, that's what it says. That's what they Just said. Taking the bolts off. So you wrap the others up and keep them moist. Well, off with the sun. Yeah, we'll keep them in the garage or something. We can take one to use them out with us. Just the ones that okay. you take out the ones you're going to plant right away. Don't take any more. All right, these are the balsam. Then come get the other bunch. These are the balsam first. And these are four year olds. Right here. Why don't you wait and open them out there? We'll take the, we'll take the scissors with it. Mm -hmm. That keeps them in a That keeps them together until we get out. Of the, uh, the balsam first is probably going to be the first one I'd plant. And these are roughly 16 inches. And they're the four year old trees. Okay. And until next time, live it, love it, share it. And I'll be, next video will be a, uh, a planting video. It's way too windy for you know, anything to happen outside with the camera today. So we'll see you next time.